Once upon a time, in the whimsical village of Quirkville, there lived an eccentric inventor named Professor Puddlefizz, renowned for his bizarre creations. One sunny afternoon, inspired by a vision of transforming snack time, he set out to craft his masterpiece, the Automatic Snack Dispenser 3000. After days of assembling a colorful contraption filled with gears, springs, and what looked like leftovers from a vending machine, the invention was finally complete. It buzzed and blinked with a flashing sign that read, Snack Attack. Eager townsfolk gathered in the village square to witness the grand debut. What snacks will it dispense? queried Mistress Hubble, the local cat lady. Only the best, declared the professor, his eyes gleaming. With great theatrical flair, he flipped the switch. The machine roared to life, whirring impressively. But instead of dispensing delightful treats, it erupted in chaos, hurling snacks into the air. Gummy bears zoomed past stunned faces, Popcorn descended like fluffy confetti, and chips sliced through the air like frisbees. The village erupted in laughter and mayhem as everyone danced and dodged the airborne snacks. Meanwhile, Sparky, the professor's loyal dog, joyfully chased after the gummy bear missiles, barking with delight. Mrs. Hubble's cat whiskers leaped and twirled in a comedic frenzy, adding to the absurdity. Instead of a catastrophe, the automatic snack dispenser 3000 became the most entertaining attraction Quirkville had ever seen. Ultimately, Professor Puddle Fizz decided to turn the chaotic machine into a festive snack launching device. Every summer, the village celebrated Snack Storm Day where free goodies rain from above, proving that sometimes the craziest inventions bring the most joy, and reminding everyone that laughter is indeed the best treat of all.